ordering a meal. Hello, I'll be your waiter today. Can I start you off with something to drink? Yes, I'll have iced tea, please. And I'll have lemonade. Okay, are you ready to order or do you need a few minutes? I think we're ready. I'll have the tomato soup to start and the roast beef with mashed potatoes and peas. How do you want the beef? Rare, medium, or well done? Well done, please. And I'll just have the fish with potatoes and a salad. At the doctor's office. What seems to be the problem? Well, I have a bad cough and a sore throat. I also have a headache. How long have you had these symptoms? About three days now, and I'm really tired, too. Hmm. Sounds like you've got the flu. Take aspirin every four hours and get plenty of rest. Make sure you drink lots of fluids. Call me if you're still sick next week. Okay, thanks. Asking directions. Excuse me, could you tell me where the library is? Yes, it's that way. You go three blocks to Washington Street, then turn right. It's on the corner, across from the bank. Thanks. I've only been in town a few days, so I really don't know my way around yet. Oh, I know how you feel. We moved here a year ago, and I still don't know where everything is. Calling for help. Hey, that car just ran a red light and hit that truck. Is anyone hurt? I don't know. Let's call 911. Hello? I'd like to report a car accident near the post office on Charles Street. It looks like a man is hurt. Yes, it just happened. Okay, thanks. Bye. What did they say? They're going to send an ambulance and a police car right away. Good, they're here. I hope the man is okay. I know. You have to be so careful. At the supermarket. Hey, Julia, look at those desserts. How about baking some cookies today? Hmm, yeah, that's a great idea. While we're here, let's pick up the ingredients. Okay, what do we need? The recipe calls for flour, sugar, and butter. Oh, and we also need eggs and chocolate chips. Why don't you get the dairy ingredients? You'll find those in the refrigerated section in the back of the store. I'll get the dry ingredients. They're in aisle 10. Great, let's meet at the checkout. Okay, see you there. Running errands. Hi there, how can I help you? Well, I'm in town visiting for a few days, and I need to get some things done while I'm here. Sure. What do you need? I need to get my hair cut. I also need to have my new pants hemmed. Okay, here's a map of the city. There's a good hair salon here, which is just a block away, and there's a tailor right here. Is there anything else? Yes, I'll need to have my car serviced before my long drive home. <laughs> No problem. There's a good mechanic a few blocks away. At the post office. What can I do for you today? I need to mail this package to New York, please. Okay. Let's see how much it weighs. It's about five pounds. If you send it express, it will get there tomorrow. Or you can send it priority and it will get there by Saturday. Saturday is fine. How much will that be? 11.35. Do you need anything else? Oh, yeah. I almost forgot. I need a book of stamps, too. Okay. Your total comes to $20.35. Catching up after class. Hey, how did your physics exam go? Not bad, thanks. I'm just glad it's over. How about you? How'd your presentation go? Oh, it went really well. Thanks for helping me with it. No problem. So, do you feel like studying tomorrow for our math exam? Yeah, sure. Come over around 10 o'clock after breakfast. All right. I'll bring my notes. Shopping. Can I help you? 
Yes, I'm looking for a sweater in a size medium. Let's see. Here's a nice white one. What do you think? I think I'd rather have it in blue. Okay. Here's blue in a medium. Would you like to try it on? Okay. Yes, I love it. It fits perfectly. How much is it? It's fifty dollars. It will be fifty-three dollars with tax. Perfect. I'll take it. Transportation. Should we take a taxi or a bus to the mall? Let's take a bus. It's impossible to get a taxi during rush hour. Isn't that a bus stop over there? Yes. Oh, there's a bus now. We'll have to run to catch it. Oh no, we just missed it. No problem. There'll be another one in ten minutes.